This is my neighbor 2004 Chrysler Tana Country. Um, she's using a Monster cigarette lighter FM iPod. Um, this then sounds horrible. It doesn't work. And this is the third one. FM modulators do not work. Um, we're gonna install a better iPod interface in this vehicle. Uh, but before I do that, I wanted to show you how it works. Here's the iPod, it's in play. If you put it next to the radio or inside the cassette, it plays. But if not, it doesn't work. So we're gonna pull all this out. Uh, to get to this radio is pretty easy. You open the uh, uh, cup holder and this little plastic here comes out um, it's kinda difficult to do it with one hand there we go, plastic is out uh, the sun is not helping uh, two screws under it probably will move the car away from the sun and then once you take the uh, two screws out just pull this out and the radio is easy to remove four little screws one two three four before you do this your radio needs to have a mode button this is not going to work without the mode button um, and we're going to be installing this. This is the Chrysler O2 PC Pod 2 from Precision Interface. Four screws, the radio is out. We're gonna be putting this. This is pretty simple. This is the interface. Vehicle harness, plugs right here. and the iPod cable plugs in the other end. So now we have one plug for the radio and one plug for the iPod. This is going to plug in the back side on the back side of the radio. Radio must have an empty plug on the back side. That one. Make sure it locks in. That's it. And now we can put the radio back in the dash. There is space on the back side of the uh, radio to put this box. It can stay right there. Um, you can hold it with tie wraps, um, but it's not going anywhere. Now I'm going to put the radio back in its place. Okay, everything is back. Now I'm gonna plug the uh, iPod. Kind of difficult with one hand. Uh, 
and the battery is charging I just realized the other cigarette lighter didn't charge so it's working we're gonna leave this there and now to listen to the iPad we're gonna press the mode button that's my iPad sounds good Now I can switch tracks, as you see my iPod is switching songs from the factory Dodge Chrysler radio just by pressing the uh, sick button up down let's see That's my iPod playing. Um, let me see what this does. Uh, I guess this button, the one through five, don't do anything. You have to use the. Uh, oh, this moves fast forward, and this moves the. Uh, the sig moves the uh, songs in the iPod. Sound quality is great. And fast. controlling everything from here. If I want to go back to AM FM, I can go back. If I want to go back to it says external disc and we'll start playing in a second. Everything from the factory radio. Better than any FM modulator.